On the deck, below the bridge wing. Well, it's being called one of Russia's most aggressive military moves in recent memory. Russian fighter jets flying low and close to a U.S. naval destroyer. And take a look at this map behind me here. You see this area right around the Balkans. The fighter jets swooping in extremely close right in this area. American sailors got the intimidating air show in the Baltic Sea yesterday as Russian pilots made several simulated attacks on their ship. Looks like you may come across the uh, flight deck, coming in low, bridge wing level. Below the bridge wing. Below the bridge wing. Navy officials called the maneuvers extremely aggressive and warned of escalating tensions between the U.S. and Russia. We was unable to find her owners. Um, had she been microchips at the time, we might have been able to reunite with her original owners. She's microchipped now, though. She is microchipped now. So when they come to the dogs, we microchip all our dogs. Right. And this is the problem, isn't it? I mean, let's talk to David about this. Um, many people thinking, well, why should I? I haven't done it for so long. It costs, what, 20, 30 pounds. Why, why do I need to bother about this? In 10 days' time, it's going to be the law to, to do it. But more importantly, what, what microchipping will do is will be to actually get the dog back to the, to the owner if, if the dog uh, goes stray or, uh, or inadvertently gets lost. And I think that's really important because it gives peace of mind to the dog owner that they can find their dog again. Well, what, what will happen if you don't do this? I mean, yes, you can face a fine, but how are you going to track people who haven't microchipped their dogs? What, what, are there going to be people on the street trying to trace microchips in dogs? Yes, I mean, as you, as you know, we have dog wardens who are out uh, in every local authority looking, uh, looking for stray dogs. It's their job to pick them up. From the 6th of April 2016, it will be a legal requirement that all dogs are microchipped and the details of the keeper are registered and kept up to date on an approved microchip database. Now, the law changes on Wednesday the 6th of April, meaning that dogs must be microchipped or pet owners could face a fine of up to 500 quid. I'd like to speak, um, Madam President, on an amendment that I have submitted that will ensure the implementation of what is already required by statute, a biometric exit system from the for the United States. Law has required a biometric, that means a fingerprint, not as opposed to biographic, which is name and birth date, a biographic uh, system that allows us to know who comes in this country on a visa and whether or not they left when they were supposed to leave. It's absolutely critical to the safety of the United States. It's something the 9-11 Commission in 2001-2002 recommended as a high priority.